shocking blue. And number 10, the sun is still shining here in London. Wow. It's been out for over an hour now. Amazing stuff. Hope it's the same where you are. And I hope you're enjoying the show. Pick of the Pops uh, from Radio 2, uh, Chicago. I'm a man at number 9. At number 8, Tema Harbor, Mary Hopkin. And at seven, uh, Rolf Harris, Two Little Boys, and at number six, this became the group's only major hit in the States, reaching number ten. On their chart, it's Marmalade and Reflections of My Life. Reflections of my life at number six, weekend in the 14th of February, 97. I'm really enjoying this uh, chart, aren't you? And I'm difficult to please, actually. I hope you're enjoying it as well. I tell you what, let's go into the top five right now. And at number five, it's Bad Fingers. The fastest thing in the air. Pick of the Bob song, BBC Radio 2. Number five, written and produced by Paul McCartney and featured in the movie The Magic Christian. It's uh, Pick of the Pops here at BBC Radio 2 with me, Tony Blackburn. And at number four, here's Jess Rotel and The Witch's Promise. Double A side, actually, the other side, The Teacher, but we'll play uh, this song because we like it. Rotel, the Witch's Promise at number four. Just a reminder, Dermot O'Leary will be here with you at three o'clock this afternoon. And thanks to Claire, who's uh, sent me in an email and says, uh, please say hello to the hard workers in the cash office at Costco Lakeside and listen in every Saturday. There are, of course, other supermarkets available. <laughs> BBC Radio 2, Tony Bankman here with uh, Pick of the Pops, and at number three, here's Can Heat. Let's work together, held off the number one spot, but this week's chart topper, we'll hear soon. work together at number three and at number two John Denver wrote this song in 1967 when he was stranded at the Washington airport and a lovely song from Peter Paul and Mary leaving on a jet plane here at Pick of the Box on Radio 2 Glad they, that one took off. Uh, leaving on a jet plane at number two. Let's have the chart rundown right now, shall we? <laughs> Chart positions the weekend in the 14th of February 1970. Here they come and down four to this week's 20, hitching a ride, Vanity Fair. Down two to 19, someday we'll be together, Diana Ross and the Supremes. Up 18 to 18, Wandering Star, Lee Marvin, down five to 17, Suspicious Minds, Elvis Presley. Up 12 to 16, Wedding Bell Blues. That comes from the fifth dimension. Down 4 to 15, all I have to do is dream Bobby Gentry and Glenn Campbell. The Temptations at 14, I can't get next to you. Down 6 to 13, Ruby, don't take your love to town. Kenny Rogers in the first edition. At 12, I want you back for Jackson 5. And at number 11, Friends from Arrival. 
Number top ten at number ten. And up eleven places, Venus, shocking blue, down one to nine. I'm a man, Chicago. Mary Hopkin goes up two. Tema Harbor at number eight. Down five to seven, two little boys, Rolf Harris. And down three to this week's number six, Reflections of My Life. From Marvel 8. A fabulous fiver on the way. It's an on-mover at number five. Come and get it, bad finger up two. Goes Jethro Tull. To number four, the witch's promise and teacher. Up twelve to three, let's work together, can't he? Still at number two, leaving on a jet plane. That comes from Peter Paul and Mary. Still at number one, love grows where my rose goes. Edison Lighthouse. Five-week run at the top of the charts, Edison Lighthouse, Love Grows, where my rose we go at number one. In a moment, we're going to go to the 10th of February, 1990, and it's a terrific chart, I promise you that. This is BBC Radio 2 online on digital and on 88 to 91 FM. <laughs> 